as you move from high school to university, not only does the level of subject difficulty increase, but so too does the frequency of group projects. From lazy team members to group conflicts, there are many issues that can arise in a group project. That's why in today's video, we will lay out the steps one should follow in a group project to maximize efficiency. Clear Expectations First, your whole group needs to have their collective expectations summarized. This may be as straightforward as producing a PowerPoint or as complex as planning an event, but it is important that everyone has the same end goal. Division of Labor Every member in the group needs to know their role. Attempt to divide the end goal into a number of tasks equal to the number of group members. For example, if you are planning an event, one member may be dedicated to advertising and finding an event space, while another may find vendors and talent for the event. Regular group communication. All members should be aware of the progress of all other members, such that no member is left behind, and if anyone needs help, labor can be redivided. This can be easily done by creating a group chat. In conclusion, the creation of a group project relies on the cumulative success of all members, and by ensuring all links hold strong, you can be sure to expect the best results possible. Thank you for watching, and we hope this helps you reach your next level of excellence.